Hi, my name is Kathy Lacey. I am the Prevention and Diversion Coordinator from the South Alamo Regional Alliance for the Homeless. And my journey with um, helping homeless veterans started back in 2013 when I began working for the American GI Forum as a case manager, trying to understand why we had homeless veterans when I know what the homeless veteran had done, the housing system um, had done for me as a veteran. So the community, um, we ended um, um, veterans homelessness in May or June of 2016, around that year. And since then, we've been able to stay above board just by providing services to those who were normally not able to receive it. Um, and they still get the wraparound care. Um, the South Alamo Regional Alliance for the Homeless and all of the partner agencies um, that work with veterans, the South Texas VA, um, the city of San Antonio, um, we have formed the Veteran Working Group or We Case Conference, those hard to meet, match veterans with housing services, be it for criminal, criminal past or income um, or even housing or rental history. We have been able to reach out to them and to get them stably housed um, through that case conferencing. Um, it's been a really, really great feeling to be able to see that my brothers and sisters are getting what they need um, as part of a community that is focused on being um, Vet City USA, right? So, uh, Military City USA. It, it means something to me to be able to go out to my brothers and sisters through outreach and through coordination to make sure that even those who are not um, VA eligible or healthcare eligible are still able to get housed um, so we can get them off the street and get them the care that they need to be continually sustainable. Um, what, what I see next um, coming up or what I'm hoping can be um, um, a precedent in San Antonio is the way the community came together we have systems that have already been tried and true and proven to be effective through our mayor's challenge that we have been implementing still. We haven't stopped the fight in eliminating um, veteran homelessness. So we still have those systems in place and welcome the challenge of going out again and digging deeper to find our brothers and sisters who may be displaced. Um, and for those who need help, right, to get them immediately the help they need to get them housed and get housing stabilization and reunification for them and their families. Um, that's, that's, that's the plus of this community that we're always going to pull together to help um, not just our veterans, but everyone to be able to call their house their home. So um, thank you.